Saint Faustina, feast day, October 5th. Early Life Helena Kowalska was born on August 25, 1905 in Gogowek, Poland. Her parents are Stanislaw Kowalski and Marina Kowalska. Saint Faustina had nine siblings. She was the third oldest of them all. Her family was poor, but they were very religious. When she was seven, she attended the exposition of the Blessed Sacrament. That moment changed her life forever. After that, she wanted to become a nun, but her parents didn't allow her to. Quick Fact St. Faustina was a good student. Becoming a nun St. Faustina went to her party with her sister Natalia. She then heard Jesus telling her to go to Warsaw. So she took a train to go to Warsaw secretly without telling anyone, including her parents. She never packed any clothes or knew anyone in Warsaw, but she trusted that God would show her the way. She went to many convents but was rejected because she was poor. But finally, the congregation of the Sisters of Our Lady of Mercy accepted her under the conditions that she would pay for her religious habit. On April 30th, 1926, she received the name Faustina at the age of 20. Two years later, she took her first religious vows. Quick fact. Before searching for convents, St. Faustina went to St. James Church and prayed every day. Life as a Nun On Sunday, February 22nd, 1931, St. Faustina saw a vision of Jesus wearing a white garment with red and pale rays, coming from his heart. He said, Paint the image according to the pattern you see, with the signature, Jesus, I trust in you. I desire that this image be venerated, first in your chapel and then throughout the world. I promise that the soul that will venerate this image will not perish. She met the artist named Eugene. By June 1934, Eugene had finished painting the image based on what St. Faustina told him. Quote, Know that the greatest obstacles to holiness are discouragement and exaggerated anxiety. These will deprive you of the ability to practice virtue. This quote was said by St. Faustina. Death. In 1936, St. Faustina was diagnosed with tuberculosis. On March 23, 1937, she had a vision that the Feast of Divine Mercy would be celebrated in her local chapel and would be attended by large crowds. In July 1937, the first holy cards with the Divine Mercy image were printed where St. Faustina wrote the instructions on the back. St. Faustina died at the age of 33 on October 5, 1938. She was buried on October 7 in her house, but was later moved to the Basilica of Divine Mercy. Quick fact! Mother Irene, St. Faustina Sr., showed her the Divine Mercy booklets while St. Faustina rested in her bed. Canonization St. Faustina was beatified on April 18, 1993 by Pope John Paul II. St. Faustina was also canonized by Pope John Paul II 
on April 30, 2000. In October 2011, a group of cardinals and bishops sent a petition to Pope Benedict XVI for to Faustina to be made a doctor of the church. On May 18, 2020, St. Faustina was added to the general Roman calendar. St. Faustina is the patron saint of mercy. Quick fact! St. Faustina was added on the general Roman calendar on Pope John Paul II's birthday. Overview Birth, August 25, 1905, in Gogolek, Poland. Parents, Stanis Kowalski and Marina Kowalska. Death, St. Faustina died on October 5th, 1938 in Krakow, Poland, at the age of 33. Saint Faustina was canonized on April 30, 2000. Saint Faustina is a patron of mercy. Prayer. O Jesus, who filled blessed Faustina with profound veneration for your boundless mercy. If it be your holy will to grant me pure intercession, the grace for which I fervently pray, my sins render me unworthy of your mercy. But be mindful of Saint Sister Faustina's spirit of sacrifice and self-denial, and reward her virtue by granting the petition which, with childlike trust, I present to you through her intercession. In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. The end. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe to know more about other saints. Thank you.